Hey, so really quick, I'm gonna explain where the two uh, rollout switches are. Well, one's a rollout switch and one's a high limit switch on a fryer. Uh, the rollout switch is up on the burner, and when that thing trips out, uh, that means you have some sort of problem that caused uh, an excess of heat, I think of 250 degrees in that burner area. And when that one trips, it typically means that the air is not moving through the burner properly. If it's a if it's a naturally vented system, if it has a combustion blower on it, you might have something else going on. So you want to make sure you uh, check your range hood, make sure it's pulling proper air. Um, just checked it; it's right over there, up on this roof. That's why I'm up here, and uh, we were good to go there. Uh, the second one is the high limit, and that's if the fry pot itself ends up getting too warm. What happened in this particular instance, they actually just filtered the oil, they turned it on, and they hadn't gotten the fry pot drained closed all the way, so the oil slowly drained out, and uh, it kept heating until it overheated, smoked some of the oil, and tripped the high limit. So I'll just really quick show you where those two are. If you reset it, and it ends up tripping, like, right away, the next day or whatever, later on in the day, then you probably are not gonna wanna reset it again and just let it keep going. Because if you continue to reset it and it continues to trip, you're gonna end up melting your controls or damaging the gas valve. Just There's a lot of components in there that if overheated will be damaged. So if there's something going on, you wanna call a technician, have them come out and look at it. So if you have to reset it multiple times, you probably got something else going on. But if it's just kind of a one-off thing, then you can just reset it. This is the flame rollout. That should only be reset by a qualified technician. This is the high limit reset. Right back there, that button will be popped up higher than that. That'll happen if you run the fry pot with not enough oil and it heats up too hot. Yeah, that was the problem on the fryer. It was just that high limit one that had bumped up because the oil had drained out of it. But again, I just caution you, if it's the rollout switch especially, uh, you need to figure out what's going on if that trips more than once. Um, because if it's not drafting properly in these Pitco units, it'll wreck the burners and it'll wreck that baffle and stuff. And it can be very expensive to repair and very dangerous too because if it's not drafting properly, you'll have exhaust gases coming into your kitchen and then you have carbon monoxide poisoning hazards and stuff like that. But anyway, hope you enjoyed and uh, that this helped you out. Talk to you later.